In this tutorial we will train on different challenges when building a scene. Challenges differ depending on modeling methods, formats, or the platforms the imported files were exported from. That been said let's start off by opening the exercise file found in scenes and renders folder. Keep that folder open as we will be dragging object out and into the viewport. Our goal in this exercise is to add some furniture in this empty wooden house, to be able to do so. One must have clear view over the house, in Composer we have many options. 1. Hiding and showing. Can be a very fast way but it requires a model that can be entirely broken apart, which we don't have here. Switch to fixed rotation if you want by clicking on the spin navigation icon. Let's go back, double click the model to select entire assembly, then hit the show icon. 2. Zooming through the walls. In this you may need to edit your camera to see more surroundings and bump less in through walls. Three, using a section plane. The less has a way for this exercise. Go to menu bar, create, section plane. You can move and rotate the plane, but for a precise 90 degree, open the Precise Transformation panel. Go to Menu Bar, Tools, Precise Transformation, or hit Ctrl plus R. Double click the clock and hit zoom to object. To begin with, the clock on the wall is tilted and the dragger, as known as pivot is not symmetric on the clock, not to mention it's way off the center. No big deal. Just go to the Precise Transformation panel and hit the Advanced tab. Zero up the X and Y orientation under the Object section and pivot. But keep the Z for now. Now instead of copying the X, Y, Z values, which is fast and easy. But since we don't have anything to do, let's learn how to use the Snap Pivot tool. First select the object by double clicking, then hit the snap pivot icon. Then hit one of the edge loop selection tools, in this case the square one. Composer will automatically generate the edges for you. Zoom and select the edge loop. Selecting the middle one will result in placing the pivot in the center of the object. Two options will appear in the upper right corner of the viewport. Select the green one. There you go. The clock is done. Now let's add a fireplace. Drag and drop the file called fireplace.
Use the snap object tool to snap it to the floor under the clock. Hit Ctrl R and rotate it a 180 degrees. Rescale using the Scale tool next to the Move tool. Now click and drag the sphere in order to scale. Now let's lay our backs and watch this scene getting built. But pay attention on the lower left corner, keystrokes will be displayed. Those shortcuts can make your work much faster. Next video we will add texture. Thanks for watching.